welcome back with another ROM review after a long time I'm back with a custom ROM review and this is called ethereal OS let me show you from the settings and in this video I will talk about two major things and one will be positive another will be negative of course so I'm going to uh, divide this review into two part one will be positive part another will be negative part so I'm going to start the positive part for the first okay here's the about section android version 13 and ethereal os android version 13 and which is called aura and this is official for redmi 7 and really thanks to device maintainer i'm code 3x for building this one and kernel used here since per viper 3r plus and I didn't check this is kernel issue supported or not. Maybe it is supported. Uh, I will let you guys know later. And then the smoothness is just mind blowing here. We have device settings included here. Earpiece gain and headphone gain, microphone gain, MI sound enhancer that really improves your sound quality. And we have gesture settings here. Navigation system. And this is pill radius can be customizable here you guys can customize it pill radius pill length can be customizable and this is like this and the amount of screen height used as touchable region for back gesture and hide imei ime button space and i think you guys already know about that basically this is the gap between keyboard and the bottom part of the display and press and hold, double tap, swipe the screenshot, fine, everything is working. And here is the ethereal updates. You guys can check this. I have no internet connection here. Then we can go security option and we have one new feature which is called auto reboot. If you want to make your device auto reboot, you guys can set a timer for maximum 72 hours if you want auto reboot your device uh, within 72 hours you can set that one a specific time which you want then we have face unlock and fingerprint and app lock as well and everything fine working i already tested no issues with that then we have the wallpaper and style by default we have some wallpapers this is called the default wallpapers and which is ethereal os wallpapers you guys can use if you want and i really don't find any good looking wallpaper here by default so that's why i'm using a third party then we have display settings as usual all android 13 custom room actually has this feature now let's talk about the ethereal hub this is the customization hub status bar almost all the customizations available then we have the quick settings brightness slider position secure lock screen hide qs in secure lock screen that means in lock screen you guys won't be able to use the control center if you enable that feature this is the feature then we have the theme if you want to use vibrant expressive sprays uh, rainbow whatever you want you can select then we have the color source both default wallpapers or home wallpaper or any presets you have then we have the lock screen and authentication double tap to sleep everything fine working i already tested and we have uh, as usual one default crt and scale screen of animation then we have the power menu system as usual advanced reboot option you guys can enable disable screenshots miscellaneous we have pulse unlimited google photo this storage and i already checked it it's fine then unlock high pressing games that's also working and click to partial screenshot that also working no issues with that and this is it's real hub customization now let me show you network and internet here we have and which is called Force LTEC carrier aggregation support. You guys can enable 4G plus. This is setting UI. Now let me show you 
the dialer you guys will get by default call recording which is auto call recording without any beep any messages you guys can record no problem and gcap 9.2 the very latest one which is perfectly working here i am showing showing agc 9.2 here i already make a video on it then we have default camera which is the normal one and we have another one i guess which is google camera go by default i am using here the custom icon pack just go to home settings you guys can customize icon pack i'm using here the aura and you guys can select the default one and if you need any new just click on the plus icon here on the top right corner then you can go to play store then download which one you prefer and miscellaneous we have you guys can use taskbar allow home screen rotation hidden and protected application actually all necessary features are available in that custom room app drawer themed icons force monochrome themed icons whichever whatever you want you can set and we have other customizations like uh dark status bar status bar uh top shadows and horse seat background which i'm already using an extended style and then we have the music search themed hot seat search bar that means this search bar is called themed and this is the IMEA button space you guys can see here at the bottom or you guys can customize it and by default we ha we have the features and this is the calculator and then we have the widget settings and wallpaper as usual and the control center is in dark mode always as it is based on pixel type experience so that's why but it's a bit customized that's why uh, it's in a rectangle shape not in normal type oval type shape like uh, android 12 or 13 type it's a yeah, mod modded one and i'll personally prefer it so it's really good you guys can go with it no complain about smoothness and anything but i found one thing and which is google maps google maps is not perfectly working here i tried many times but it cannot detect the location or uh, it's not working perfectly i found this one and another one after adding gmail you guys won't be able to get your contacts here it cannot connect to contacts it cannot sync your contact uh, this is really a bad thing for those people who actually uh, uses their contacts on emails uh, just like me and I didn't ab able to sync any contact here but you guys can add any contact if you want to if you want to add any contact you can do that no problem with that but it cannot sync from your gmail and this is a bad thing so that's why it's a bummer for some people and of course another thing which is uh, google map this is also a bad thing so that's why i think in next update it will be fixed okay let me show you some things and which is this is cpu performance and which is really great and that was 87 percent and let me show you another thing which is uh max jp scores which is 158957 and average 149 and that was really good and that was for 100 trades and here you guys can see google pixel can unlimited backup and pixel backup you can get it no problem with that and this is the review hope you guys understand if i miss anything just let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching